pop star. These are be bad. Mary Wadman. Good morning. Ooh. Good morning, everyone. I don't know why my face is red. I don't know. It got red last night and like hot while I was talking, and now it's just stayed like this. Happy whatever day of Vlogmas it is. Today is actually December 1st, which is exciting. We are about to go grab coffee at La La Land. I haven't been to La La Land in like two months. So we're making a return. We were gonna go on a walk this morning, but it's literally 30 degrees. We're off. Oh, yeah. We're off to see the wizard. Anyways, we're going to La La Land. I'm wearing this really cute, cozy outfit. We were gonna go on a walk. However, it is 30 degrees outside, which I would still be down for if we had like hot coffee. That's cute, but I need like mittens at this point. Like it's really cold. Sweater is Revolve. I am like obsessed with chocolate brown as everyone is right now. I ordered more sweaters offline. I already had a chocolate brown set. <laughs> Guess I was ahead of times. I don't like how my nails turned out, so I'm painting them chocolate brown. I don't know why I didn't just do chocolate brown at the salon. You know when you have to pick out your color and you're just like really stressed and you just pick the first thing you see because like they're staring at you and I was the first person there and I felt like I was holding everyone up even though no one else was there. They just put a lot of pressure on me at early time in the morning. Anyways, like I was saying, we were gonna go on a walk. It was really cold. We were like coffee and here we are, you know what I mean? <laughs> Wait, what? It is December 1st. Why are these here? Wait, no, they normally are decked out for Christmas. Are they open? Yeah. No, they're open, but. I just cannot believe that they haven't decorated for Christmas and it's still a fall menu. It's December 1st. Guys, it doesn't even feel cold anymore. Guys, I'm truly appalled that their Christmas decor is not up. And Lala Land has cute Christmas decor. You know all this Dallas TikToks with all the decor? They could be in them right now. They could be. They could be one of them. They could be just decked out. Like, completely. I know. And then normally, have you been? Did you go last year during Christmas? Yeah. No, normally it's like Winter Wonderland in there. I just couldn't believe my eyes. I haven't really been going to Lala Land the past two months. And to come back to it like this was disappointing. Disappointing, to say the least. <laughs> Kenzie, you look like a, <laughs> a bug. No, you look like a famous celebrity. Ooh. Like, everyone's like, ooh, who's, who's that? Who's I believe that this was like literally a foreshadow into what you guys will see later in the vlog. Just stay till the end, okay? Who's that? Guys, I have just gotten nothing but great news this morning. And it's, Wait, it, dude, it's a sign, bro. It is a sign, and we have a very important meeting today, and we're very, hoping- Very, important. We already have plans today, um, tonight, but we're hoping those turn into a celebration for our hit meeting. I feel like God is like, okay, blitties, it's going down today in the Yeah, meeting. like, you've been through enough Yeah, so, like, year. here's, like, some good news, hunty. Yeah, I mean, let's talk about this. If the news isn't even enough to describe what this news would mean to me. Yes. No, you don't understand. It, like, it's like I the will, birth of my firstborn child. Like, you don't understand. Like, like I will be twerking <coughs> in the streets. Yeah. Because, you know, like, we need it. If 2020 was a bath bomb, it would be a toaster. <laughs> <laughs> Jokes like a dad. Everyone, please join us in 21 days of prayer and fasting today for Dom and I's meeting. Yesterday, yes. it was for Dolly Parton to come on my, my podcast. Amen. So please join us today. That's good. Come on, let's hear it. Good, good it's who you are. It's so beautiful. Who you are. It's who you are. Right here. And <laughs>
seconds preaching orange. Six here. Orange? Yeah. Well, guys, as you know, there is a verse in the Bible and it talks about um, it talks about being lukewarm. And as Christians, we are called to not be lukewarm. We're called to be on fire for the Lord, like not like we're on fire. And I know when I think about lukewarm, I think about an orange. It could have been better, dog. I, I really don't know what Christmas is all about. All right, guys, I'm ready for the day. I edited yesterday's vlog, got that up. Then I did my makeup. Um, I ed it only took me like an hour and a half to edit this vlog. So I'm feeling good about vlogmas so far. I'm heading upstairs to take our very important meeting that we're hoping is a big hit in like 10 minutes, so. Look how I just look so much taller than you. What chair? Oh, she's on a different chair than I am. Also make this one go like low to the ground. <laughs> you do? Yeah. Dom messes with my chair and I just don't even notice. Well, I noticed like the first time and now I just don't notice. It's so tall. Like you do that with your car chair too. You sit up like a bus driver. <laughs> Whatever. Um, so we have a very exciting meeting. This is like actually annoying, but like it's Vlogmas. What am I supposed to say? Lie? <laughs> yeah. What do you want us to do? Yeah. Oh, you know what? Maybe we need to get Starbucks and we go get Christmas lights. I'm gonna get Christmas lights for outside Ooh, today. Wait, can I, I decided I'm doing it. Okay, so can I just go after this meeting? Mm hmm And then What come are you back? doing? What? <laughs> why would you tell me dogs that you like car for something? Why are you yelling at me? <laughs> you you sound like the guy that the Snapchat guy last night. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> the psychopath. Bro, and that's the thing. That's why I honestly guys don't talk to me because a lot of them are about the tomfoolery. And if someone <laughs> literally true. got buck with me. That's the last time they'll ever get buck in their life. Someone gets buck with me, I just laugh at them, and then I just am like, okay. And then I'm like... Yeah. I mean, I'll get buck back, and then I'll laugh at them. Yeah. Opening up the Zoom! <laughs> you need to see the vlog from yesterday in the part of you with Fitz watching Go More Girls. It's so funny. I, I really don't know what Christmas is all about. guys we finished the meeting it went well so it just things just take a long time and it's really unfortunate when you're me and you just want to start everything right this second and unfortunately that just isn't the case however it still is looking good um if any of you guys have any guesses leave them down below sorry to be annoying but it is just something that I truly believe was just made for me and Dom. Anyways, I'm going to record the intro and outro to today's episode, or not today's episode, to this week's podcast episode, which is with Amy Chan from the Breakup Boot Camp. Well, not from, well, yeah, I guess actually. We struggled with matters of the heart. You know, I was able to excel in school, get good grades, do well with friends and have awesome jobs. But the one area I was always heartbroken. And so I actually started writing on the topic of relationships relationships like 13 years ago because I just couldn't figure it out. So I would dive into the psychology of everything, the science, everything. And I was like, if I could just figure this out, then I'll be okay. Right. Super high achieving, controlling person, you know, type of an approach. Yep. And, you know, after this breakup, I, it, the idea of breakup bootcamp didn't come to me just yet, but I was really struggling. I, I, she has a book called breakup bootcamp, which it's so much better. Like it's not just about breakup stuff. What I really loved the most about this book was attachment theory. They reached out for her to come on the podcast. And originally, like, that's just not something I would have, like, really been into is, like, talking about bread. I don't know. Whatever. And then I read what it was about. And actually, guys, this book was so good. I think everyone should read it regardless of if you're, like, going through a breakup or not. Like, just literally so good. It's actually, like, way more about you than it is about, you know, anyone else. So it was just so good. So, oh, my gosh. I'm really excited for this podcast episode. I actually think it's one of my favorites that I've ever recorded. And Amy was just a doll. I loved her so much. Seriously, she's so great. So anyways, I'm going to record this intro and outro and get going with my life. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? All 
All right, guys, still at my desk here. Um, I am actually about to go guest on someone else's podcast that I will be sharing. I'm really excited. I follow her on Instagram and she's so cute. I'm really hungry. It's 1.30. I just finally set everything over. I'm actually trying to send over edits to Facebook because I'm working with them on their podcast vertical. So I need to send some edits back over to them. And I really need to heat up some chicken noodle soup for lunch. I had a late breakfast, but I'm getting hungry. I really love going on other people's podcasts. I don't really get the chance to do it so often because I actually am very busy. I know that um, in my vlogs and on my social media, it probably doesn't seem like it, but I'm literally working all the time. Um, but I am just really excited. If you guys have podcasts, I love coming on and I'm always willing to come on, um, but I probably just won't be doing them for at least the next month just with Vlogmas and everything going on. Guys, Dom took my car and came back with the gift. I'm afraid of what... It's because she's filming. She wants to make herself look good. <laughs> okay, are you ready? Wait. No, did you see this on my Let's Know It? No. I oh, oh, was I looking at it in your show? Yeah. Wait. <gasps> wait! Dom! Okay, no remember if that was the color you wanted. I like all the colors. Dom! Really? Yeah. So I will cook for you more? Yeah, sure. Um, <laughs> see guys, I told you Kenzie's 75 year old ass would be excited about. I am, I am so excited. <gasps> Dom! Thank you, these are so cute. These oven mitts were on. I need to tell my mom because I think my mom, I have to tell her she can't get them for me now. <gasps> the tablet stand. You have no idea how much this is going to improve my life, Dom. No problem, Kenzie Elizabeth. Oh my god, yeah. these are exactly what I. Oh, it's very, so perfect. I love them. I'm so happy you're enjoying everything. <gasps> and that? then I'm like, go literally going to buy a baby bolster for Coco. Yeah, I'm actually a little bit concerned for you. You and Coco have really like created this bond that is um like now she's trying to bark when I don't pick her up. I know. Well, okay guys, Dom started we Coco just the only reason that she barks is because she wants to be eye level with all of the humans. So Dom just holds her but carries her like this. Yeah. 24-7. And if I had a, look, if I had a little baby carrier, Coco could sit like that. This is what she wants so bad. Like, she wants, she's begging for it. Look, Coco likes it. <laughs> I don't look, know about that. Look, Coco. Hi. Aw. Well, First off, heated up some chicken noodle soup that I made last night. So incredible. The recipe is in the last vlog. I'll on my Instagram. Or it will be soon. The bucket list for Vlogmas. And I would love to add to it. Um, <gasps> is it... With you kissing someone under a mistletoe? No. What I was actually going to say is that I would love to find you a winter break fling. Kenzie! <laughs> You're into it? No. Well, yeah. Okay, let's get on Hinge. Okay, well... <laughs> Are you okay? Okay, wait. I, <laughs> I want... I want to be related to you. <laughs> okay. Well, my parents have already taken you, and I don't think... I only have one brother on the market that's around your age, and I don't think that you would like him like that. What's this? Which one is this? Ryan, the oldest one. <laughs> he's a skater. I just don't feel as though he's emotionally available. <laughs> Neither am I. <laughs> Great. That would be awesome. Kenzie, I have a confession, and I wasn't going to tell you this. What? But I... <laughs> You found that you have a date? <laughs> no! Wait, what? Two nights ago, <laughs> I did make a hinge. Okay. Okay, and then last night, this kid started texting me. So you were just gonna live under my roof and not tell me this? <laughs> no, I was going to tell you because I'm gonna let him out. Okay, but the thing is, I was gonna tell you, but here's the problem, Kenzie. Is I'm living a secret life on Hinge right now. <laughs> Why? Because they think I live in Austin. <laughs> <laughs> no! I thought I was gonna, well, because I was like, I don't know if I'd find a guy in Dallas, but I'm so confident that I'd find a guy in Austin, which is true. But now, that's like three hours away. 
Oh my god. I so that's why like, you said we should go to Austin this week. You are, oh my god. You were going to have me drive three hours to Austin and not even tell me this. No, I would tell you. No, you weren't. You were literally not going to tell me. Yes, I would, Kenzie. I would just, no, come on. But it's not that serious. It's not that deep. It's not serious. It's not deep. Right, Coco? Yes, Dom. You're all right. Oh, there's this other guy. He's in Austin, too. And he already tried to ask me on a date, but I lied and said that I can't. Cause so, I'm, like, when they ask you, like, where do you live around Austin, like, what do you do there for fun? Like, what do you say? I haven't been asked that. <laughs> okay, that's when you're gonna text me, hey Kenzie, if we were to go to Austin, like, what's something fun that we could do? You would have literally kept up the act. No, I would yes. yes, this is the second time we're out getting coffee today. But yeah, I forgot we went this morning. This is my friend. I think this is my friend. How are you? Good. Good. Best Starbucks order. Oh, it's not on here. All I need is a reindeer. So Got some Starbucks. Well, we somehow found ourselves at Nord Park and going into Nordstrom. Dawn was literally here an hour ago. She really needs a coat. It's actually like 30 degrees and she doesn't have a jacket and she needs one. And we were out in... She's vlogging. <laughs> Guys, okay, we're in Nordstrom. I'm gonna give you some gift ideas. These puzzles, but these puzzles, like that's so cute. They're little mini puzzles, like, okay. These are really cute little sheet masks. My niece would love. I don't really wanna carry a bag right now, but like, oh, she loves this stuff. Like, she just likes doing it with us. Free people is looking beautiful. Oh my gosh, we have to go to anthropology. Is there one here? Yes, well, we've been. It's my favorite one. Guys, should we do a shopping challenge video in Vlogmas? Just thinking of all the content we could get. And I think if we did a shop with me, like a Dom shops for me, I shop for her. A shopping challenge. Just you for a holiday. For a holiday, yeah. It'd be good. Guys, Dom does not own a pair of sweatpants. Yes, Dom. These are nice. Wow, they feel great. I'm actually really impressed. Again, I'll link these below, guys. What else am I gonna do today? No, like, <laughs> it's so over. soft. Okay, wait. Dom, they're so they soft. Have them in black, maybe? No, but I love this color. They have a green. You don't like green today, so. I do like green. No. Oh, wait, turn around. Found them. Oh, slay. Because wouldn't this be such a cute Yes, outfit? that's so cute. It's very me. I'm turning into Kenzie Elizabeth. <laughs> yeah, basically. Yeah, so this is what my gingerbread houses look like when I do them too. Like, look at that. Like, are you joking? Ah, uh, beautiful. Ah, uh, yes. The Christmas trees. Ah, uh, so magical. Back to my favorite place. I don't know what has happened to me, guys. This is so beautiful. Like, look. Hey guys, Dom just keeps making all these jokes that are not even funny. No. <sighs> that are inappropriate. And then we, like, meet people who, like, watch our videos. And then we're, like, crying, laughing so hard. But it just, like, wouldn't be worth it to explain why we're laughing so hard okay, because it's not even he, funny. No. And then Dom... Funny. Kenzie was talking about a piano player. Oh, what's it called? Say it. No, because you just. No, we're done here. It like really wasn't that funny. Like. <laughs> She's out of breath from laughing. <laughs> I tend to do that to people. I'm a comedian, if you will. It is so beautiful out. Dom found a puffer <laughs> in the den. We didn't even need H&M, Dom. I can't see Elizabeth exclusive. Yeah, Her exactly, closet. my closet. It is so pretty. It doesn't even feel, honestly, like that cold out. It just feels good. We got changed into real outfits. We are going to this thing called Miracle. You have to get reservations. It's like a bar 
more really a restaurant. It's just really festive. It's not like you go out to a bar. There's reservations, it's all distanced, and that's pretty much all I know is that it's really spaced out. And then they like have them at multiple locations. It's basically just a pop up, but it's on Greenville. So we're excited to go. Sav is going with us, um, and we have reservations. So. You know. Guys, look at Dom, the vlogger. Tomorrow, I'm gonna be way more blonde, everyone. Just get ready. Guys, how lucky am I to have such a beautiful rooftop all to myself? I just use my smile with my teeth instead of trying to. I guess I really don't know what Christmas is all about. Go. Oh, sorry, did you want more selfies, Dom? <laughs> Guys, this is where we're going. I mean, oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. That's not roasting. All right, guys, so you like have your own little area. It's all spread out, it's so festive, and then everything's on an app, so you like don't even talk to anyone really. It is so cute. We're on Lower Greenville. All right guys, I got a Crispapolitan. Chips is really cute place. We ordered queso, we have chips and queso coming, and then Sab got a T-Rex. So cute. Okay guys, update. I'm good. <laughs> Neither is Sab. But like the place is really cute. We're on like the top, ready? No. This is what you do when you don't like your drink. Kenzie mm -hmm. hates her drink, so. Like, or have to. I'm being forced against my own will. <laughs> You're literally doing this to yourself. No one is making you do this. So bad. It takes me back, you know? <laughs> TikTok has driven me. <gasps> Hello! Everyone like and subscribe to Kenzie's channel. Wow. It's really, it was really not good. Um, Vlogmas is already driving me to drink. So, <laughs> just kidding. But I did try to get a drink, just like being mature and responsible, and then it's not good. I know, I'm like saying, okay, listen, the place is really cute though. I will say it's overpriced for everyone who's like, if you're thinking of coming, you have to make a reservation. I did it on the weekdays, because obviously there's no one here. Yeah, you have to download an app. It's kind of like a hassle. It is really cute, and I could see. It's smart to do it this way. Yeah, it's like smart because it's like not contact. It's contactless, but I mean it's really cute. So it's like for the experience. Just know that you're gonna like spend a little bit more money, you know. All right, so like look at this winter wonderland that is happening. It is so cute. Guys, I'm literally dying. I think that Sam was allowed to, I would assume for that large, that price of a drink, Sam so stole the dino. I'll stop at Lila's really quick. Anyways, long story short, I would recommend the place. It was so spaced out. Definitely did really, they did a, they did a really good job with it. Also, it's on an app, so you're like totally fine. It's like you literally don't talk to anyone. You just go sit at your table. Great, um, really overpriced. I didn't like my drink. The queso was good, and I would recommend sitting on like the bottom floor and not where we sat because it just like wasn't the full experience, but it was still really cute. We're gonna stop at Lila's really quick, my favorite place on Lower Greenville, and they are like the most festive place ever. <laughs> I don't know, guys, look at how freaking cute Lila's is. I'm dying out here. So cute. We made it to Lila's. So cute. Lila's was an incredible experience. We sat outside, only one's there. Sav still has her T-Rex, right? For a $14 drink, I mean, you might as well. It's in Texas, so <laughs> you might as well. This place, the merchant, is actually really cute. It's just, I, I paid like $3.75 for black coffee one morning. I know, but I just want to work in there one day. Yeah, you can't really right now because it's indoor, but they have really cute gifts and stuff, and they have really cute wrapping paper and stationery, and just basically if you need to get someone a gift last minute, just, it's the best place to go. I got it, I got it, let's go. Back, five, six, seven, eight. I just need to say that. Ready? Go. Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, yes. 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 Look. Look. She just, she just, she just waited. Okay, let's do it again. Five, six, seven, eight. Dom, hide behind the 
my all, please. Thank you. I mean, I don't know if you realize this, but it's a little see-through there. Just right here. Like, make it ready. It was the end that you got it there. Guys, I'm a pop star. Um, mine. We've been having the best night, but I'm actually a pop star. People have been tagging me and their Spotify wrapped profiles. The rumors are true. Yes, I am a pop star. This is what happens when <laughs> fame and money gets to you. When it gets to, to you. Head. Gets to you. You know, it's feeling good about it. Have you no shame, Kenzie? Sorry, Dom, hair and makeup's gonna be here shortly. So if you could please keep it down, I'd really appreciate that. Thank you. Like, my tracks are showing in the back. Like, I need to get this one out. You know what? My sister told me I'm getting extensions tomorrow. I don't know how I feel about that, seeing as how I wanted to chop my hair off. You just wanna party with a savage. Like, all I know is that my hair color right now is not it. So. It looks good. You should go, like, yellow. Wait, what? No, no. I'm going blonder tomorrow, but she wants to give me like how blonde? As blonde as I possibly can go. Like, are you going blonde up here? Yes, I want to be like blonde all the way through. That's encouraging. Guys, look at them right now. Oh my gosh, they're just waiting for me. Oh, thank you, Fitz. Oh, he's not waiting for me anymore. Okay, I think I forgot to end the vlog, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. I love you guys so much. Thank you on a serious note for everyone who has been tagging me in their Spotify rap. That actually is really, really crazy, and I may not be a pop star, um, but I am really grateful, and you guys are, like, literally the best ever. We were actually talking about that tonight. Dom's like, you actually have the nicest followers ever, and I was like, I know. They're so nice and cool, but I love you guys so much. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.